Hello everyone, it's Enigma here, and today we have a Nintendo rumor that I didn't even see anyone talk about on YouTube, and I just discovered this on the internet from a Facebook post, and apparently there's a rumor going around that Super Smash Bros. Ultimate new characters may be revealed sooner than we think. So, apparently that, well... Let's just read the article. It says, It's been one month since Nintendo's big Super Smash Bros. Ultimate reveal at E3 2018, but the game won't officially launch until December 7th. That leaves plenty of time for the company to reveal any previously unannounced characters that could be coming to the roster, but it looks like the first new challengers might be approaching even sooner than we expected. Nintendo recently shared a live stream from its official YouTube channel, where it was spotted by Reddit user Jace Beller... Bellaran98, I don't know how to pronounce that, I'm sorry. Uh, the video was set to go live on July 15 at 10 p.m. Eastern. And while the placeholder image shows a logo for Mario Tennis Aces, the video description clearly reads, Game, Super Smash Bros. Ultimate. A rough Google translation of the video's current title re reads, Aim for three consecutive wins, winning challenges, in Jump Victory Carnival 2018 Tokyo venue, which sounds like it's referring to some sort of live tournament. So what does it all mean? Um, and then it says, um, well, and then it's, so basically it's bringing up the idea of, like, a Mario Tennis connection. And then it says, well, assuming that Nintendo was holding a video game tournament in Japan, it could be the perfect opportunity to announce it a new character or two for Super Smash Bros. Ultimate. On Reddit, one fan suggests that the Mario Tennis connection means that we could finally be getting Waluigi as a playable fighter since he originally originally debuted in Mario Tennis for the Nintendo 64. Um, I don't know because he is an assist trophy. I don't know if Nintendo. I don't know if Sakurai would just remove the assist trophy and add him as a playable character. I I don't know if he would do that. Um, but let's hope at least. Another Reddit user suggests that Chain Chomp should be the latest addition to the Super Smash Bros. Ultimate roster, since the Mario character also appears in Mario Tennis Aces. Then again, it's unclear how exactly the giant ball and chain would function in a fighting game, so maybe not. Yeah, I don't think they would choose Chain Chomp as a Mario representative. Um, and then it talks about some other new characters that could potentially be revealed. And they're like, interestingly, this isn't the first time we've heard of, of a Super Smash Bros. Ultimate presentation happening in July. Earlier this month, the 4chan leak predicted that Nintendo could kick off 11 new character reveals with a mini-direct in July to unveil two new fighters. The leak didn't reveal who who they were, but refers to them by the codenames King and Ponytail. These clues have sparked plenty of speculation, but the prevailing theory is that we could get we be, we could be getting two new characters from the Donkey Kong universe, King K. Rule, King, and Dixie Kong, Ponytail. Of course, that's just our best guess. Nintendo could announce a totally unexpected addition to the Super Smash Bros. Ultimate roster during the upcoming live stream, or it might not announce anything at all. We'll just have to wait and see. I hope this rumor is true. Take it with a grain of salt. Um, if this rumor does turn out to be true, or just in general, honestly, I think the next character that will be revealed for the game will be King K. Rule. I think he definitely is the next character to be revealed. He was, I think he was probably, I think he was probably first in North America, honestly. He was heavily requested. A lot of people wanted King K. Rule. So I think that he might be the next character if, like, if the July 15th thing is real or just in general. Um, so what do you guys think? I will leave the link to this article down in the description below so you can read. But again, take it with a grain of salt. It might not be real. So what do you guys think? Do you guys think that there's going to be a little announcement on July 15th uh, about a Mario Tennis connection or anything in general? Let me know in the comments down below. Anyways, this has been Enigma and peace. See you next time.